So today I'm finally filming a video for all of you short hair girls who need to know how to curl your hair. I'm filming it with my beautiful friend, Jordan Page, and she has short hair and a few weeks ago, she tagged me in a story and asked if I could come and teach her how to curl her hair. So I was like, uh, will you come and I'll film it for that all the people who have short hair can learn from this because I have long hair and I can tell you how to curl your hair, but I can't show you necessarily if that makes sense. And so I'm so excited. She's coming in today and I'll finally have a video to show you how to curl your short hair. First, we're gonna be balayaging her ends a little bit to get her a little bit brighter on the ends. So I'll post a little bit of that process and then I'll show you how to curl your hair. It's gonna be so good. So we just got done with the color. We did a pretty balayage. It turned out so good. But we're now gonna do curling. So a few weeks ago, she contacted me and I was like, let's do a video because everyone I can't curl short hair. <laughs> I can't do it. It's, I, I feel like it's impossible. I always get a bubble, like a shelf right here. I don't yes. know how to do it. It's so hard for everyone. It's hard. So finally, because I have long hair, we're making a video. I'll show her how to curl and have her try a few pieces, but it's gonna be me sharing tips on how to get this gorgeous curl with short hair. I'm gonna take this one inch curling iron. You can use a one inch or an inch and a quarter. This one's easier for short hair, I think, because it's just easier to work with. Um, so I'm gonna start front section. I don't split the hair in half. It might be easier for you to split the hair half, but for working, it's just easier just to go vertical and then split from here in half. Okay, so with this front piece, we want this to have more movement than any of the rest because this is framing her face. So we're gonna take it up about an inch away from the root, turn it, and kind of pull it as you're turning and roll it up and see these ends. I'm gonna just keep those out and I'm gonna pull the iron softly so it still has that wave to it so it blends in but it's straight. You can see this has a little bit longer so I'm gonna take this and kind of just like do that to it and that will bring that down. So I think it's easier to split vertical and half Oh, instead of like nice. splitting your whole head yes in half. oh okay. so you're like done with one side and then you have the rest yeah because like, otherwise it's too long it's like an awkward uh -huh. split okay so you do yeah so this i could split i'm going to split one more time and then i'm going to take this one lower because i'm not going to want it to be up here because that's going to make this bulk out i'm going to take it like halfway yeah that's why that's why I get that big bubble because they all start at the exact same. Yes. 
Yeah. And then you have like the shelf of yes. like where the curls start. Because I do like some starting up, otherwise yes. it feels flat against yes. my head. But That's why I um, usually keep like this first layer, I'll do up higher. higher. Yes. But those underneath, that oh gives Oh my gosh, like that's my problem. <laughs> Okay, then this last piece by the ear, just do the same thing. As the first one, yes. Yep. Just start it up. Okay. Vertical section. This one I'm going to start on the bottom. And you'll just take it. Under so the best thing about this iron is that it has a bit of slip to it, where if you use other irons, your hair is not going to be able to like slide through it as good. And so this one, for that, is the best. It makes it so much easier on you. And then I take out like sections of hair. It's more than that of like actual hair, but the length is like an inch. Yeah. Um, for like the looser curls. If you want it tighter, you can split that. Um, but if you want to try this one, you know, like sure. Two. Yeah. Okay. Well, did I feel like I'm just turn and do as I put it down. So you can go raise your hair until I get to the end. Yes. And then kind of just kind of twist up. Yeah. 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 Yes. No, yes. that's, that's, that's fine. fine. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, because then those will like blend right in, it's underneath. And then this, this guy, this yes. is always my worst one because it creates a big old bubble. Yes. Okay, so this one I just start up higher. Uh huh. Instead. And then pull, yep. How, like, should it be tight or is it? It's like tighter is just fine. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And then you're good to just pull out. Yep. Just, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I let go. That's You're what good. I do. I let go. And then, oh. like, you can see how that's gonna blend in. But yes. you could even take that because this is crazy. Yeah. You could even take this and, and kind of just lightly. Okay, hey, that's my problem. So when you drag it down, you're not like letting go of the clamp. You're letting it actually pull. Yes. Yes. Got yeah. it. Tugging it down. Yeah. yeah. I tell a lot of people when they're like learning, like turn the curling iron off and sit on the couch and just like practice tugging because it's then you're not going to burn your hair, but like, that's the hardest part. Um, and so with your hair, you don't need to curl that like really like up to the root this whole section. Like I'm gonna just the ends, yeah, just like lightly so this section. Okay. But like since your hair is shorter, if you curl it up there, this is gonna shrink. It's just not gonna make the whole yes. hair. Yes. So honestly, just take it halfway through, and you're just gonna take this round once and then out, and it's gonna be like the lightest curl, but it's gonna and then down. Yeah. I like that you're not having to section like three times because that takes forever. It does. And I feel like this is just, it's way faster. And like if you wanted to take huge chunks, this is so much easier. Like the curls of mine, I literally just take vertical sections and I curl the whole section. I don't split it. Because it's just so much easier. She's not still She had him. And it's easier to get you once like I twist it as you yes. drag out. Yeah, because then it gets still a curl to it because you don't want it to be like stick straight and then the whole bubble. Um, so I kind of like to like take it and like twist it's like a it as a there. Yeah, and then I just go like this and then twist it up. Take this one. 
I'll start up right there and turn. That was totally my problem, was not staggering them. That yeah. Makes so much sense. It helps me. Especially with the layered like, hair. Together and, yes. Yeah. yeah. And that, like, I'm going to let this side cool, but, like, now you can mess with this side. And go <laughs> We just finished and look at these pretty curls. We no longer have a shelf, which was our problem the first time. <laughs> the bubble in the shelf, yes. <laughs> but it makes your hair look so full and long and pretty and the curls frame her face so good. Um, but yeah, hope you guys learned something from this video and we'll see you next time.